Hey, 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 DJ Mikey Mike in Direct Sound, and we're here at the Hellenic Center for our wedding this afternoon. This is going to be a very big wedding. Uh, the system's not going to be that big, but it's going to be some unique stuff happening today. We're going to be trying out our wireless solution, uh, our Gemini mic, a wireless mic, UHF, and our Line 6. We're going to try, um, uh, try to see the sound difference and see if they last all through the night, you know, things like that. So that's going to be pretty cool. Take a look around the room. Here's prior to direct sound. Ryan is with us today. He is running the cables for the uplighting right now. He's across the room. And our, my, run, my uplighting cable is one continuous power cable all the way around the room. So I provide my own power. Always having a power plug where I need it. And they have quite a few tables, probably 200, 300 people here today. And we're also going to be doing uh, a new setup for speakers. I'm going to put the main speakers behind the stage a little bit further back. Also, we're going to do front fill, side fill, and rear fill speakers using the powered active speakers, the Geminis and the Thumps today. And uh, here they are, the small 10-inch uh, Geminis. These are the RS-410s. Uh, and then also the Thump, uh, Mackie Thumps. Our system in the back. Uh, oh, also, I I'm going to surprise these guys because I want to test it out. Uh, I'm brought a pair of moving heads and vertical trussing. And the vertical trussing is for the vertical mirror ball setup. So we're going to do the ver vertical mirror balls here today for the first time to check them out uh, and get some nice, cool, sparkly sparkliness to this room. It's going to be really cool. Uh, they have a custom gobo that we're going to place on this back wall, I believe along with some Chauvet Abyss LED um, water effects to go along with it. I think that's going to make it look nice and fresh right back here. And that's about it. We'll put the two moving heads right here by the stage on the corners. And that way we can shoot them across the, the rooms to the um, mirror balls. Also, the uh, speakers are going to go back in this corner back here. So I think that's going to be... Uh, kind of a different setup. Keep the speakers out of the, the main view of the, the audience because my JBLs are just so massive, but uh, they carry well, so I think they'll just be fine. And now with the surround sound room speakers, I can get my volume a lot lower with a nice surround sound fill for the room. The guests can hear the music completely perfect. Uh, a couple uh, had a couple comments like um, from, I'm not sure who it was, on our our wireless solution says, oh, that's a terrible idea. I'm like, how can it be a terrible idea to completely fill the room with sound at a nice warm volume? But, you know, to each his own, and uh, maybe he, they can um, take a look at this solution and see if it works for them this way. Maybe they just didn't get the concept. So uh, we're going to try to do that and uh, see how it works. So, so it's uh, DJ Mikey Mike with Direct Sound getting ready to pre-set up here, and uh, we'll get going. Peace. DJ Mikey Mike and Direct Sound. So we brought the big bad boys out today, and uh, we're going to set them up right now. All right, and we're and we're in. So, uh, so that's how fast you can set up a mirror ball. I already got this, the one on the other side. It's ready to go. It's going to spin around on the side of the wall here, and it's going to throw out some amazing dots. We're going to use the American DJ 5R uh, spot to illuminate these things, and it's going to be cool. Check it out in a little bit. All right, I'll show you where I have the body pack hit. All right, here's the Gemini uh, UHF body pack, transmitting the signal to the wireless speakers.
Down and we just got set up and the guests just arrived uh, right behind me we got their gobo going and we got two LED abyss water lights going in the back it's really gonna look nice as soon as it gets dark um, I can't find my screen kings I guess I left them at home so that's kind of messed up <laughs> so uh, they're gonna have to deal with a few uh, wires when we take those up so we have two LED um, Abyss LEDs on both sides of the stage, giving the water effect behind the uh, gobo. It looks really, really cool. There's the other one with the five R's getting ready to hit those mirror balls. We got up lighting going all the way around the room. And we got our surround sound. Let's go take a listen. It sounds really good. Beautiful sound all the way around the room. It's incredible. I don't know why I haven't done this in a long time. <laughs> Probably because I didn't know the power of speakers. Here's the Gemini RS410s. Sounds really good. And here's our Gemini UHF microphone. On top of the phone speaker. It's the Gemini UHF. See if we got a nice strong signal. Gemini on the side of the room. <coughs> Sounds so nice. Oh yeah. So here's our other Gemini 10 inch.
That ball guy would be like, come on out. If you're single, come on out. Come on out. Turn the music up or not. five R's with a quick slow fade program uh, and we're taking our moving heads around the room with a nice slow fade. I'll show you what they're going to do. Every 35 seconds they make a transition around the room and they end up back at the uh, gobo in the center. As you can see they're coming down with hearts, uh, or excuse me, stars right to around the, um, the gobo. And now they're going to change to roses and go back the other direction. And then they're going to end up slowly fading around the room. So you can add some animation to your room and not so uh, static. Uh, this will separate you from a lot of the other DJs out there that just uh, have static gobo projectors. I guess they can find something to look at and get something to look at. Slowly fading around the room. It's going a little fast, we got to slow it down just a bit, give it a little more time. Maybe take 50 seconds or maybe a minute to get around the room. And now it's going to butterflies and going to go back in the other direction. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to change the time to a minute and that way it'll go a lot slower around the room. And we have a, a really good transition. Along with the uplights, we have the uh, lizard car. I love this car camp for cake lighting.